Well, they all loaded in. Did... Alright, are they there? Are they all on the right teams? Jeez, I hope so. Yeah, me too, bro. So you gotta blow up that wall, and then blow those things up. Bang. Now they're all, all up to speed. Just in um, case you haven't watched the intro movie. Anyway, this is map one of the grand final of the Cyber Gamer Open between Synergy and Tea Time, formerly Generation. And I can't switch people apparently. Well, get your binds going. There we go. Yeah, I uh, was press sniper going up to terrace. And uh, getting a bit and defense. Have someone going Overwatch as well. So. Of course, that sniper's gonna be able to pick him up. Yeah, they're yeah. running an RD up on Overwatch. You got four people just chilling in the office at the moment. They're pushing Man. all through luggage. And they've got a couple in the uh, yellow, I believe is the uh, common okay. name for it. Yep. But, but they have gotten pinched it. But inside, this 40, level 42 guy. Came out of nowhere. He won the one-on-one, -on -one, but unfortunately, you know, they knew he was there. So, Chrome's trying to yolo it against two dudes, but as long as he made spawn, otherwise I might might have to get angry at him. Yeah, and rightly so. So the defense have this RD up on uh, on Overwatch, just chilling. See how they can uh, react. So they got three going terrorists, two in the sort of office area. Push for balconies coming in. Yeah. Cool bus picks up a double. Oh. So yeah, pretty much coordinated uh, crunching on the flag there. They had the RD spam and they had the guy up on balcony still, so. Good work by school bus to, to hold off the majority of that push. That seemed to be a, a sniper frag uh, medic push to balcony, which. It's a bit peculiar, especially because you're expecting a close range fight. You don't really want to take your uh, your sniper up there on point. Also, probably <laughs> going to get rushed in a moment. Yep. By that fragger once they tell everyone where he is. Ah. Uh, money just rushes into into that coming in. But uh, yeah, the push on the balcony. School bus just doing work. He seems to be pretty comfortable up there. And that's end, ends down for 20. So is Thalon. Oh, so that's actually their Fragger and... What's Thalon playing? Medic. So they're trying to take Stoogie to... to window to take out that uh, school bus guy. That's definitely the guy you want to kill. But uh, school bus isn't making it easy for him. Chrome's... I think captured the flag. It was on it. Yeah, I don't know how much was done. Yeah, they're doing a bit of reset on it. There's a bushy around it at the moment, but Dash is pushing down for it. Pulling a bit of a D man going YOLO on it, but it's not doing much for him. It ends actually TK's his medic. And he goes down. Well, he's only in limbo at the moment. Now he's gibbed for 20. Same with his TM face. So Suji's, I think he's getting some hits, but uh, he's not able to go. finish him off. That school bus down, but not gives. And the medic's the just coming, coming up. In. Yeah. But I think Synergy had a bit of a chance to get at least a bit of a push on, but haven't capitalized. School bus is coming around for a flank, but it's not going to work out for the ball guy. Well, that's him down for, we'll say, 10. Chrome's also down. We've got a couple in the balcony at the moment. But it's still just Stoogie alive somewhere. So... Yeah, he was getting a bit of progress on the flag. But that, he's yeah. also down for 20. Yeah, so he's off wave now. Not good news. So, I think, from what I'm seeing so far, they really need a Stoogie pick with a headshot. To, 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 like, to actually be able to get any penetration here because they've got a full setup and they look pretty comfortable. So, yeah. 
bit of, bit of a push for luggage, but crossfire's coming in. Stooge's uh, moved over to Kira now, so you got your wife. Well, that's good. What the fuck is he gonna do with her on offense on this phase? Usually you swap to her when you got the the plant down. Yeah. And then now when now when they're getting the plant down. Yeah. So tea time are looking comfortable. Um. Unfortunately for synergy, they've been held back a couple of waves. Five minutes of waves. So tea time are just pretty much doing a bit of mixing it up and. Just put the pressure where it needs to be. But the push is coming in for the flag. Got Artie though. So they still have their key plays. They still have the Artie, the sort of the engineer engineer at the back, and he's resetting the flag now. But so uh, yeah, their rotations are uncontested almost. Yeah, so we've got two in office at the moment, and one's just coming into the office now through back way. Dash has swapped up to the Nader. He was on a medic, I believe. No. Engine. So yeah, Stooji rocking the dry Kira. Which is an odd choice. And odd is obviously code for... That doesn't make any fucking sense. So... I reckon... If Stooji was hitting heads... With the Vass, obviously that there'd be more chances here. I don't know how he's going to make those chances with the Kira, and he's not even using the laser, so... Yeah, a lot of people seem to be rolling the BR... What is it, BR-16? Yeah. And that's he actually did get my... A bulk, but... Doesn't mean anything. There's only one up. Yeah, that's it. And it's Stoogie. But, um... Yeah, BR-16, is, it's easier to be consistent with that weapon. For sure. It's a good choice. The Serenji down for 15. Yeah, but can they punish? Need to take out that Overwatch person before they can go through luggage. Yeah, it's a bit... It's tough because one way to sort of get past Overwatch guy is to rush hard luggage before he can shoot you. Um, but if there's no distraction on the other guys, then you're just going to get shot from the side anyway, so... It's a big mess up by the school bus. Yeah, it so now they have Valk. Overwatch guy is punishing them though. Angie goes down. But respawn coming in. Their offense is getting longed out. And they're going for the retake of, uh, of apps. Sydney gets for the school bus though. It's good. Unfortunately, you couldn't get the other medic. And uh, straight out of Mumble's gone for a cheeky plan on the generator, so... We're about halfway through this defense, and yeah. Stay long down for 15. Right they just rush... Are coming, but... nice Sorry, there you go. They just rushed that bloody... Uh, soldier now, they would have been right, but... Uh, they all got distracted and actually jumped down to the flag. And Face yeah. comes in and gets picks up a double. Ends is down again for full spawn. So the thing about this is it's gonna be really hard for them switching to defense because they've been playing offense. Probably not feeling they can get into a fair fight, and then they've got to go and sort of put some domination in once they flip, but still six and a half minutes to go, so push on uh, luggage has gone a bit slow, so yeah, that overwatch guy is just punishing them pretty hard. Get Stooji to take out the arty, then he can push in. So now I think, what's Stooji trying to do? I'm just looking at the flag area. Dash took down the overwatch guy as a bushwhacker with a kick, so that was a nice shot, but he got ended up getting taken down. But at least that means the guy's on the overwatch for a little bit. So now's really their chance if they can push together. But yeah, the push is coming from luggage, so no overwatch guy to, to punish them. And Dash is going for the plant, it's a window plant, he's got a turret on it. 
they don't seem to have the flag, and the defense will have just respawned, so they're all coming up that spawn street. Yeah, and we got two on back spawn, so it's 3v5 at the moment, or 3v4. Ends, ends is all but down, Chrome's pretty much dead. There's a little bit of a defuse on the, um, on the dynamite, but it's over halfway, but the respawn's coming in. Now we need Akira. There we go. Old Stoogy. That's the NG down. On the NG? Yeah. Clutch. And nice little shot there by Dash. So, nice little couple openings there by Dash, I've got to say. He took out the Overwatch guard, which enabled them to push the luggage, which enabled them to get the plant. And then he just took the guy that was going to try for the you know, last ditch defuse. So, good play from Dash. Now the defense has spawned forward and they're all running back like like crazy. Oh. It looks like they're going to be able to get back pretty uh, contested, so they're not opting to defend that middle phase. And yeah. that's pr probably probably a pretty good choice. Yeah, unfortunately uh, the allies have spawned all the way back rather than at the flag spawn. Yeah, that does suck. Otherwise that defense would have been in a lot of trouble. But yeah, smart from uh, from tea time to fall back because it's only about four minutes ago. So if they actually get set up, they should be right. Oh, Ooh. that's a triple school bus. Get in the quad, mate. Well, a kill. Uh, good work, school bus. He obviously knows how to play that position pretty well. Oh, and then he dies. Oh, yep, there we go. And yeah, he ends. Yeah, a couple of nice plays from school bus so far. So. See if you can keep it up. NC is trying to get some magic happening on the uh, the main entrance, but uh, gets taken down. We got three down for uh, tea time at the moment. So if we can at least get a plan at now. Yeah, Dash has been revived. So Cine doing some good work there. We got a bit of comms. Got Dash back up, but unfortunately. Wasn't able to keep up with Dash. Dash ran too far forward. Take your pick. And uh, he got taken down on long. So it was a nice little give by straight out of one wall. Um, got a plank going down on A. Both are playing the room. Both. Yep. Hello. So this is good. You know? But, we've got two offensive dudes up. Well, actually, it's a 2 on 2 situation. So. Chrome's just trying to YOLO it. Around the container. Sydney's on his own with a pistol. And straight out of Mumble's coming in for the diffuse now. And. Yeah, no one's nearby. And they almost get some in time. He had it right. It was just, it just came too late. What do you do? But it was a nice nice throw by NCA, but yeah, it's just too late, unfortunately. Diffuse coming in. Well, it's almost done on A, but they seem to be leaving it. So Travis Buckle, oh no, he was in a bit of a one-on-one, -on -one, so he couldn't really do much. And they replanted the bubbles. Yeah. Oh, they're about to defuse, eh? Oh, oh, Jesus. That was just a bee's dick. Oh. And yeah, the other one's almost defused, but NC, I think, took him out. So NC, he knows his angles. He's just got to work on his timing. Um, still two defensive dudes up around uh, the containers. And we got two offensive dudes up in the uh, balcony. Dash needs to get in and plant A. Yeah, but he's running off the clock tower. Yeah, unfortunately. He was trying to save the B plant, but uh, no dice. So Stooji thankfully gets taken out off the spawn, so they can all spawn together. Couple of nice plants there. By by Synergy, but unfortunately... Um, retake's too good by two time. And, you know, T-Slime just playing for a bit of a delay, they've got a nice little airstrike on main to stop any kind of push. Fuji running with a knife, so... Definitely didn't think he could actually get a plan or anything. But it still is possible. Dash is getting a plant on B. He's getting a plant on A. We got overtime at the moment, I think. Until these are well, defused or blown up. No, so it actually has proper time. It, has, it was... Before 50 seconds. So if they can hold this, and I reckon Stuji could still be alive if he'd actually led with his uh, 
with his like, secondary weapon there. Which is a bit unfortunate, but uh, Dash has got a turret up. He's trying to cut off the re Resakers. But only two dudes up alive now, and we have the engineer defusing. And he gets oh, a double. Enzia, Enzia he's, he's got the skills, man. He's got it, but unfortunately, he's just one man. He's but one man among many. So Suji almost got some clutch kills there as well, but um... And they'll, they'll get one, at least. Better get beat. So that was almost... almost a, a uh, destruction of both, but uh... NC is doing some good work. I think um... Probably Dash and NC are probably my, my two playmakers on offense. Defensively, uh, you know... Gobus is obviously consistent in what he's doing. I mean, you can't argue with 38 frags. What's your forecast here, James? Um, I honestly think T time will barrel through for a stage. Yeah. I don't think our yeah, first phase defense was ever strong. And how long they actually delay second phase? Who knows? But James, this is a grand final, mate. This is the time for big plays. This is the time to step up. You got to believe in your team, mate. You got to believe in Dash. You got to believe in Stoogie, Encia, Cine, and that other guy, Chrome, <laughs> who runs the team. So Stoogie, he's sniping. So he better be ripping fucking faces off, mate, because a defensive sniper here on low is a risky thing. Bang! He gets one kill on Travis. Bang! He almost kills the frag and pushing luggage, but doesn't. We got a big play for flag coming in. Yeah, we got two yeah, people on number three, three now. It's a fucking lemon party on the flag, mate. Right now, there's a black dude, a German chick, and a Spanish guy. And that's not something I'd watch on Red Tube. So, the retake's coming in. The school bus is up in, uh, in office. And I saw that nade coming a mile off. But it wasn't enough. Did you try so, to catch it on your screen? Well, that's neither here nor there, to be honest. But um, still, first phase repelled. So, very coordinated push though by T time. Um, they all, you know, they knew what their objective was, but unfortunately, you know, they got uh, they got pinted. So fairly standard sort of uh, attack coming in. We got two terrorists. We got an airstrike, I think, coming from window. Yep, there it is. And we got. Three dudes pushing out of gen now. Suji with a headshot on face. Bang! Straight out of mumble goes down to Suji. Travis Buckle tries to yellow the flag, takes down Dash. M4 too strong. But, uh. He's also lagging. That's, uh. That could be handy for him. Apparently he's lagging. All I see is. Well, apart from Travis, is all 100 ping. No, oh, well, I'm just watching him now, and he was just like, you know. Definition of a rubber man. So I think they got the flag of that. So that terrorist push is obviously successful. Um, and now, synergy and damage control. Dash pushing up through the uh, luggage. Don't think he'll get much. He's got a bit of back rage. But he hasn't been able to win this one on one versus Travis, even though Travis has been pretty fucked up. So, what are we looking at here? We're on half spawns at the moment. Four and four. The synergy really needs to try and get this flag back. So we got a fragger up top in apps. He's he's killed out. So that's a forward spawn. So they know they've got control of the flag. Chrome is about to meet four dudes. Just pretty much a standard main for him. <laughs> two pushing, uh, two pushing Valk on offense. They're trying to crossfire this flag, they're trying to get a bit of a retake on this flag, but I don't know how much it's done. It's a 2 on 1. So NC here going up for the reset on flag. They have spawned forward though. So we're NC the one man army. It would be nice to know if they had actually retaken the flag, but unfortunately we don't get that notification. So NC is doing some, some good work. Defensive airstrike came in. NC got a, a nade on the flag, dudes, but that means he's. He's popped up for 17 seconds. Yeah. What? Uh, three on... Four on flag now. 
It's a flag fest. But I think the offense may have spawned, or rather defense, may have spawned forward. Um, because they were all grouping up in the spawn streets, so... But I think the the next spawn will definitely have the defense spawning back. we got a plant coming in on the window side, or window plant. Um, Played it a bit. Yeah, that was some handiwork. So, you know, th that few seconds could pay off. Yeah, it's MG plant now. Uh, yeah, we're around middle. Travis picks up a double. Tuji gets a double as well. Okay, Tuji, calm down. Tuji with another headshot. Tuji's going big. But can it buy enough time? Well, considering they all just spawned, the offense are going to have enough time to stage an easy defense at that point. So, the defuse is coming in from a medic, and he's doing some funky jumps. <laughs> but, uh, unfortunately, no dice. Energy is uh, actually opting to defend this wall. It's about right, we usually leave it for maybe one or two waves and we fall back. It's a big how, ask. Depends how we go on supplies. Yeah. So, Suji taken out. One time wide, it's not so bad. Two on two, will the defense fall back though? Um. Cinny down for long spawn. Face gets taken out by NC going the back way. We have three, four. Actually, three in gas tunnel. So, offensively tea time, they have a couple of good tools right now. They've got a Nader, they've got a Bushy, and they've got a Fragger. And uh, that's going to make things hard for Suji. Because um, he can get spammed out wherever he likes to camp. Plant's going in on A. And it's down. And all they need to do go. is blow up one. Bus with a camp. The three people just chilling behind the. What are they? Containers? One's at main entrance, flanking around to the people underneath the MG. A dash in the dash. middle of everything. Actually, defused yeah. one of them. Yeah, you got B, but he hasn't got no. Other way around. You got A. So yeah, so that's now, uh, a blown. That's interesting. You didn't finish on that, hey? No, I think they actually need to blow them. Oh, whatever. I don't know rules. Rules, rules, man. This is the CG DB open ladder. I don't know. Do they abide by the rules? Let's find out. Well, the the rules are basically whatever the game screen says. So at this point, the game screen will say it's uh. The tea time of one because they planted and blew up a faster. Um, unfortunately, synergies on the first phase offense at this point, so pretty solid um, from from tea time for sure. You know they haven't really been shown to like they haven't really shown much weakness. So pretty solid uh, first map for them. That's map one to was it tea time. The school bus going big with 57, so pretty well played. Um, pretty even oh, shit, you did distribution too. on synergy. Got two in the 30s, and uh, the two medics just on the 15s. 
for about 15, so. Yeah, nice coordination there by Team Time. A couple of big plays here and there. I think what, uh, what got Synergy through there a couple of times were just some advantageous picks on some people that were holding, pretty much holding the Team Time defense together and then they managed to capitalize, but uh, it was a, a long sort of five, six minutes of mix ups before they got to that point, so. Bit unfortunate. Yeah, do you remember who voted for that map? Yeah, well, howdy. That's a big negative. Well, looks like we're in the chapel. So James, what is Synergy's best map? I actually thought it was underground. Alright, stink. Although we don't go... Oh, not live, okay. Not that bad at, um, Chapel. Terminal's definitely our worst. So I guess this is a bit of a new situation for Synergy um, and Tea Time because the open ladder's best of one, I believe, right? Yep. So, can Synergy take the loss on Terminal, not let it affect them, and bring it back on Chapel? Let's find out. In the next episode of Dragon Ball Z? I never got into Dragon Ball, mate. I like that, uh, I watched a bit of Cheese TV back in my time. Oh, who didn't? But, uh, well, I'll be honest, I watched a lot more aerobics style than yeah, Cheese yeah, TV. Yeah, it's more like Hello! I'm talking about. Got bullets for you. This is before you red tubes, you u pawns, kids. This was back in the day, when all you had was the aerobics style at 6 30 in the fucking morning and a copy of TV Week. That's all you needed. So yeah, I don't really know how this is going to go, like, uh, yeah, it's, I think it'll come down to how Synergy play on the first half, if they're attacking or defending, before we can really get a proper read, you can only hope for the best, then we'll get to a third map. Well, Stooji was still on the sniper the whole game, like he usually does. I'm reloaded. Except when he wants to go Kira and not use a laser, that's, that's a thing. Yeah, he'll probably go care of. Uh, I was gonna say, depends how he goes in the last phase, if they make it there. He might swap it up to Kira and throw that beam around. Well, that's it. Well, actually, fucking forget the Kira, man. If you're gonna get Stooji, if Stooji gets the third phase, you, you let Stooji do Stooji. You know what I mean? Because that's, that's his playground. But uh, in these tight, tighter sort of areas on the way up to that phase, um, he's forced into a few less uh, beneficial situations. Um, and yeah, from there it's really, can the four other players in Synergy keep the momentum going, keep the tank going, all that sort of stuff. Tea time seems to have a few answers or different situations, so... Actually, let's see if we're ready. Here we go, James. This is it. This is Chapel. Match point for tea time. Can Suji go big? Can the school bus get a six-man nade? Probably not. 
but I'd like to think he could. We all believe in the school bus. And I don't really have a lot of fun memories of school buses, to be honest. But that's another story for another time. So, to steal one of Volcano's lines, well, yes, we all know what this does and what to do here. Now it's time to play. Oh, I forgot how to play this map. Well, too late, mate. Uh, I'm gonna have to go back for lessons now. We got Cindy on Sparks this time. Travis this is, is on Artie. NC picks up NC the double. Oh! NC takes out the rival frag and his medic. I cannot complain with that. The only thing Synergy needs right now is to repair the EV. But they are Sans Engineer. So Cine is starting the build as a Sparks. Um, I don't know whether whether T Time have gotten onto it though. So Suji's is taking some shots, but no, no real luck so far. They cottoned onto the sparks on the EV and they, they arted him. Suji with a headshot on the, the nader. That's good. The bushy dash. Old dashy boy. He's getting it. Dash baits him around. Him. He's like, yeah, just run around here while Suji shoots you, mate. So still Suji, lo lone man standing, mate. He's just the last dude. But uh, he doesn't really care about the EV. He just wants to chill out. Hoping to get some picks. So, D time's still pretty aggressively crafted here. They're still setting up their first phase defense, even though the tank is they know that they're still going to be for it. So, Dash is doing a good job of keeping the uh, EV on the map, so that's good. Cine peppering the people from the front. And the Arty Gib, just to make sure. Two people at Bell Tower. School bus takes out Chrome with a nade to the head. And that's a wipe for Synergy. Tea time, five men, or no, four men, now five men up. Now they're really going to need to split up how they attack here because they're just asking for trouble if they all group one, one sort of area. Yeah, they're putting the sniper classes in the middle of the road while the rest are going Bell Tower. I tell them not to do this every time. Put everyone in bell tower. Just, just looking to get naded. That's it. So school bus ended up getting revived there, it seems, even though. Yeah. That's Cindy down for 20. That's not what you want. You don't want one of your medics going down for 20. Dash is a bit alone at the moment because, you know, he has got a medic which might have been Cindy. And yeah, D time still holding their first phase defensive positions essentially. Rome just needs to bugger off and hide for now. Yeah, it definitely needs to stay alive at the moment. But it looks like a bit of a road push coming in, with Frag going low. Dash is coming up for the bills. He's getting it started, but uh... You know what, he's got it. That's yep. good. But, they're all over it, the defensive team. It's so 3 on 2, 2 on 1 now. Can the school bus hold off? Whoever else is up there. They need to get this fucking tank moving right now. And Chrome needs to go back and revive Cine. Ah, uh, Vegas Cine. Get, get XP. <laughs> That's it. So, they set up dudes at the top of the road. The guys in red. So, I'd expect. Well, I mean, what are we seeing? We're not, we're not even seeing a Skyhammer from. Um, what's his knack? Is at the moment we're seeing a Nardi, so. Nardi need a combo. Dash is beautifully repairing the EV though. Needs to keep that fucking torch going though. He wants this to get rid of faster. That's a nice flank on the people going the back way. Of uh, red. Now they're gonna take out everyone else. Now we're coming up to short spawns here. That's good. I think Dash Dash killed out. Smart play. Because otherwise that would have been his complete fucking waste of a spawn. The Suji. You know, I hate to say it at the moment, but unfortunately his aim is, it just seems to be off tonight. Yep, as and as I say, I say that. that, he gets a headshot. <laughs> Bang! I say that more often. But so in that first phase, there's the he airstrike. Gets love. Um, trying to break open the defense. So, we had a Skyhammer switch up there. The Suji, you know, I hate to say it at the moment, 
but unfortunately his aim is, it just seems to be off tonight. Well, as and as I say that, that <laughs> he gets a headshot. Bang! You see that Moroccan? But Zay, that first phase, there's the airstrike. Love. Um, trying to break open the defense. So, we had a Skyhammer switch up there, so for the night he just Skyhammer, who was a well placed airstrike for sure. Just sliced the tank right through the Thalon middle. picks up a triple kill in red. And a very potent aura Skyhammer combo in the bottom of red there, from Aura Station as well. Definitely not a place you want to push. Travis could swap back to his arty now if he didn't want to play his uh, Sky Hammer. That way he can just keep spamming out the airstrikes. Yeah. Guess he just feels more comfortable on the, uh, the M4. It's easy to be consistent on the M4, I find, because it's, you know, it's easy to hit scan for the reverse fire sort of thing, so. You can at least contribute to the damage even if you're not finishing the kills off. So we're seeing Nader, Fragger, Sky, and two meds on the defensive team. And the rotations are coming in pretty well, they must have some good communication going on T-Time, I think. Fops is down for now and they also take out one of the medics. School bus getting a triple, mate. It's going hard, man. Got the pistol out. As soon as he finishes him off, though. Defensive Nader is still playing funny buggers around the tank. The dash is there now. Well, actually, was it dash? Yeah, he was there. Drop that turret, got the tank going. But another airstrike, mate. Straight on it. What's up with that? Give me that XP. But Need to get again, level like, 20. I reckon dash is gonna be level 50 by the time this game is done with all this fucking airstrikes on the tank, mate. It's, uh. We do have something that I do like to see. Ensia, he's out the back. He's a backyard boy. He's killing people like crazy. He's going up. He's killed Travis. He's killed two dudes. They can. It's pretty much just like Fast and Furious with the NOS. Get the tank on the fucking thing. But enemies are spawning now. They still have school bus and a medic in the garage. And that tank is all but delivered. There. City, do not run away. Do not City. run away. City. <laughs> Sydney. Sydney, what are you doing to me? There you go, good work, oh. Chrome. Who was that? Give that man a medal. Whoever that, that was Chrome, yeah. Nice play, Chrome. If we need someone pushing an extra six inches, mate, we know you're the man. So, defense is falling back. So that was nice play, and you know what? That was all ends here. He threw them into this race, I shoot him in the fucking back. Allowed that escort to happen, so... Nice, nice play by him. Still, tea time. They managed to fall back safely and they've got their thing set up so now this is when suji can come into his own and he does with a headshot on straight out of mumble so that's a was a short a spawn, spawn though yeah yeah fortunately for theon it was a long spawn for him and that soldier and ncia gets two don't know if they got revived no they got given look put both medics on ncia that's my hot tip for the night he'll get all the work done so we've got three dudes at the rock, OBJ at the bridge, enemy spawning. So Chrome's gone off for the OBJ. He's got a bit of the fumble fingers. He's coming now, but they're all at the bus, mate. They're at the bus. They know you're there, Chromey. Oh dear. Oh dear indeed. Suji takes out one of the medics for the defense. Suji could go and cap. Well, that's a big one. Yes. Dash. Dashy mate. boy. That was some nice work by the Dashmeister. So the enemies uh, spawned back in. So that was a couple of really nice offensive butchers there on the third phase. Notoriously hard phase. And we've had basic, like, basically almost wipes on tea time. So they've up to bring the, the OBJ through the oven. Or the cubby or whatever you want to call it today. And Sydney's running as a Sparks, which is great. Because she's like super fast. And the cap's already coming in. James, what did I tell you, mate? Did I not tell you? There we go, that that's more like it. That's gonna win the map for them. Did I not say that? Ten minutes ago? Maybe I did. But he basically fucking did. This guy's got skills. Better put him he on the contract. <laughs> mate, give me his address. I'll express post something there tomorrow, mate. But yeah, buddy, uh... Not level 42. For nothing. Um... What do we got in the chat? We got Presh. 
coming into the chat saying, Stoogie and Dash getting work done. And it's true. Stoogie got a couple of nice headshots. Unfortunately, he had a very, very quiet first phase. But then he uh, he got some nice picks on that last phase, coupled with Ens here. Just doing what he does. Um, but before we get too hype, I still got to hold this. Oh, just Don't in case you forgot. Park the car in the shed. And put the milk jugs inside. Why does you lactose intolerant, mate? I don't care. I like almond milk, personally. I'm an almond milk man. So this is an alright time. It's under 9 minutes. So... I'm hoping Synergy have got a bit of confidence here. They're running a nader on Bell. It's uh... The school bus doesn't care. Yeah, they're all looking the other way. But they do get picked up in the meantime. And straight out of Mumbles is getting a free repair on the tank with the Morris Station, so that tank is going to move, basically. And Travis so, takes out the left side flank. So Ensir is pretty much a one-man army, but uh, he cannot kill them all by himself. Um, straight out of Mumble, he whiffs the Fletcher Grenade, which is pretty easy to do. They like to stick to pretty much anything and everything. Dash gets a nice little airstrike on the bridge, but... Is it going to destroy the thing? No, unfortunately. Did so, it? Oh, yeah. it did. It took took it almost to the end, but um, it's at a bad spot because the bridge blocked some of that explosion. Now, tea time. Already know what's going on. Chrome gets a nice little uh, flank on on the fragger, so that's something. But the tank's still rolling. So Suji started out as a nader there. Unfortunately, it was sort of not really much love there. Tanks just a couple of bullets away from being destroyed. Knight is destroyed now. Yeah, if it gets built again if the, and the uh, airstrike's not up, oh, Cindy's also misspawned. Uh, yeah, Studio will need to play Nader. And the repairs already happened, so tanks rolling. Offensive Nader hitting the red balcony area. Suji not getting much luck. Long range sniping. And the, the counter spam from the offensive team, very strong. So T-Sun definitely know their spots. Double kill from Stooge, but re revive have come, revives have come in. And we got four men around the EV at the moment. Jesus, school bus. So airstrike's coming in, but will it get the tank? Yes, it does. tank is broken. Did it get the NG though? Uh, NG, NG. No. There's still three offensive players around the tank. NC is still the only dude there. And unfortunately, got longed. Very unfortunate. So, you know. And a slash kill might have been a better play there, for sure. And when I say might have, you know, definitely preferable. So, tank is rolling again. It's four on five. So, they're going to have to have a nice crossfire here, otherwise, they're pretty much, pretty much burned. Chrome picked up a triple kill. One. Oh, he almost got the Freya. Chrome, can't you kill 15 dudes? Come on, man. Why only 14? So, the tank needs to be stopped at all costs. Now, Dash is up on, on Balk. He might have had a, an airstrike in the pocket. Probably not, actually, because he got one on top of the road. Three ones on top of the road, but. They need to pray to the gods of OzDB right now. The tank needs to be destroyed. Hopefully, they got him. They haven't slackled out Dash. There we go. What's up? Alright. Suji better move the fuck away from that tank. Nope. Now <laughs> he's just gonna oh, take it. <laughs> oh boy. Alright, so the tank's destroyed at least, but it is four on three. So they need crossfire or a lot of headshots. Otherwise, T Time are gonna get this. The NG's a long way away, it's just it's coming from spawn now. So City needs to get some health on Dash. Someone needs to help out Dash. Alright, there it is. Good work, Cindy. Garage push is coming in. It has been wiped. Now they need to rotate their attention, though, just to make sure this doesn't come around the, the backside. So I think straight out of Mumbles, maybe trying to do a bit of a trick jump here? No, he's... He doesn't know what he's doing. He's dancing. He's lost control of his life. Well, haven't we all? Isn't that why we're here? On, on Twitch? And in this server, because we're avoiding <laughs> our lives. But Stooge gets a headshot. Oh! He gets a double name. This is it. This is it, James. Bang! That is four down. Straight out of Mumble, still fucking doing the jig over at ammo. But they've got the crossfire. 
They have the power, they have the technology, James. Synergy can hold this. And hold they if will. If they don't get triple needed. It's a hard push for Garage coming in from T time. Only Dash there. He dies, which is fair enough. Ensia takes out school bus. It's Gibbs school bus. But two dudes make it out of uh Oh, Stooji! Stooji with a headshot. There is an uncubed engineer. He is revived. And Come on, the give, offensive give, engineer. He's, oh, on yeah. the, he's on the MG. That's okay, they give the engineer. That's something. And there's still two dudes two dudes up for the defense, so you know, we can take a breath. That could have gone a different way, for sure. So synergy keeping it together. This is good. So let's just make sure that uh we send them all our positive energies, James. I've got my crystals with me on the table. I'm gonna channel some of my Peronis over them if I have any left. They're doing crystal. Offensive. <laughs> hey, crystal's crystal, man. Offensive best right coming in on the tank. Doesn't get anyone. It's a hard push of dark to garage. So school bus knows he's getting shot in the back. He goes and takes the fight to Cine. NC picks up a double kill. And TKO's his own medic for his trouble. Look, I don't care if NCRT KS the whole team. He's killing the entire fucking tea time team, mate. This guy hates tea. He's obviously a coffee drinker. And yeah, like we just got our basic, we got a basic defense set up on the tank. They're using the tank as cover. They're trying to get some forward reads on where they're coming from, so it's all looking good for this energy at the moment. Fortunately, that NG's been called out now on his location, which is MG. At least he should have been, just to kill the medic yeah. there. Dash knows he's there, can he win the one-on-one? -on -one? He does not. Because straight out of Mumble brings an MG to a gunfight. Fair enough. Manages to run around from our spawn, he gets killed but then revived, so I reckon he's gonna get the build here. Oh, he's Unless... early on the airstrike. Oh no! Dashy boy! No. So, look, all is not lost. We have six, five seconds to spawn. They can, they can still set up their defense, so shit happens, you know what I mean? They can still control it from here, they just need to keep it together, so... The reality is, with that airstrike, it could have gone either way. It could have, it should have been a bit deeper to the right, but obviously it didn't go his way. Objectives coming from Garbo's side, though. And they're building the bridge as well, so... It's something I don't see you lot doing much anymore, or at all, as in the Pro League teams. Yeah, well, you know, I don't like to be generalized like that. I just want to say that at the moment. But, um, yeah, it's not that, that kind of a strategy, but, you know, meta shifts all the time. So, Dash got the return on the OBJ, which is good, because the offensive team was half half on the way to, to Garbo to go and grab it again. The school bus push on Archway, it's taken down, but uh, Travis got out of Oven. And as I say that, they have control of Rock. The offensive team have I think they delivered one already. No, I don't think so. It did get returned, because there's not like one of the yellow things to load del delivery EMP, so I think... But the OBJ is coming to rock at the moment. Chrome has killed one of the dudes, and yeah, they've retaken rock, so whew, that was a close one. I'm sorry if my bias for synergy is showing through, but you know... Rose before hers, am I right? The Good dash intentions is, uh... there, Tash. Dash? Dash. <laughs> oh, Dash! You come with the airstrike. Oh, you. So, nice little play from Dash there, just getting an airstrike up there, just to throw them back a little bit, bleed them for a bit of time, make them think about a couple of things, and obviously it's been enough, so it's mathematically impossible at the moment. So, pretty good hold. Pretty good. Great, great offensive plays on Chapel from Synergy, and great scramble as well on defense. Fa face this team, or oh, tea time, all oh, looking really, really strong in that first couple of minutes for sure. Um, they had an answer for the first defense that uh, Synergy set up. They got a nice roll on of the EV out to near the Red House, but they managed to bring it back, Synergy. So, third map, here we come. <laughs> oh, Remedy. Yeah, what map? Good question. The 
the one that says Stoogie Ice Man. So, what do you think there? Uh, what do you think the sort of mental aspect is at the moment, James? Do you reckon anyone on either team really gives a shit? Or do you reckon they're shaking in their boots? Ah, well, howdy. What are you thinking? Not much as usual. The old brain cells are burnt out. Fair enough. <laughs> well, you know what I'm thinking. I'm thinking there could be some momentum for synergy coming up. But, like I said, tea time, they prelude themselves. They're, they're known as the oiliest team in Australian Dirty Ball. So, if there's a crevice, they're going to slip through. So, I, I don't even know. I don't know what to say. Because I think that was a really strong performance from Synergy on Chapel. But it was also a very, very strong performance beat time on Terminal. Very strong. So I don't think there's like anyone showing as a clear favourite. Off bridge. No, off bridge for third map. I'll take Trainyard over that. Ah, oh, Christ. That's almost past my bedtime. Big dog went to bed ages ago. Uh. So bridge. This could either be really exciting or really fucking boring. I uh, know we usually do the rhino thing, so you got that. I don't know what generation does. Probably the same. Uh, I'd like to see what Stoogie does on last phase, since it's not great for sniping. On well, side. overseas they do some pretty sweet shit with a sniper, getting any phase on any map, but... Yeah, but that guy's ridiculous. Yeah, I think, uh... Got bullets for you. Stoogie hasn't had a lot of competitive sort of play experience, so... Not sure what do we have to do. Reloaded! Here we go. Bridge. Decide a map in the grand final. Synergy attacking. Tea time. Generation faces team defending. I don't know who picked the map. But this is it. This is for all the marbles. Not that there are any marbles in this particular league. But bragging rights are better than marbles, mate. In my what, what do you mean there's no marbles? Mate. Who did I get my marbles, marbles time to? Ago. You don't have any marbles anymore, mate. God damn you lost them a long time ago. Oh, there he is. So they've called... Okay, that's not live. Yeah, one dude was just hanging in the spawn. I was doing it all hype before, and now it's like not hype now, because we're not live. Okay. Yeah, you get that to was, do it again. That was the, yeah. it, right. it was the warm up one. Alright. Can we pretend like that joke about the marbles didn't happen? I can do that one again. Because I was working on that on my lunch break today, mate. Pretty short lunch break, was it? It was barely a break, yes. Okay. Bridge. 
Synergy versus Faces Team. The decider map of the grand final. This is it. This is it for all the marbles. This is where you go, I have what marbles. Fuck it! This is the this is the decider map, James. Grand final. Grand final? Grand it's the grand final, my It's friend. the grand it's final, is it? It is. Between it's what been, teams? You had the fucking AFL grand final, then you had some rugby shit grand final, and now you got this. Alright, we saved the best for last. This is it, the decider fucking map. Got bullets for you. Tea time versus synergy. Synergy attacking. NC, the level 42 man. On Fragger. Let's see what he can do. We got three going Bridgeway, one at main. Where'd the other one go? Oh, he's at stairwell. So it's a nice offensive spam coming in from uh, from Synergy, but they got suppressed back. NC made a play for pushing sort of back green, but he got shot in the back. Got a bit of repair on the tank. Just under and halfway. Look, it's looking good. Um, Chrome's there. And straight out of Mumble. He's a rhino. He's just chilling. He's having a hard time killing people, but it is pretty much a wipe. NC is the last man standing. I don't know whether he should YOLO or at least sort of hold and, and try and make sure they don't push up on them. Uh, no one ends, you'll push out at 20 seconds and die. Well, I reckon he's learned how to keep his cool, alright? Um, he's just chilling out on the fire escape behind the office, and he's waiting for his teammates. So we've got half the build on the tank. That is not a bad thing. So... Is it? Dash is on the front of it. And he almost gets to revive, but gets gibbed. There was a big distraction sort of on the spawn alley there, but uh, it was way telegraphed, so it didn't really do much good. Dash is coming up to a, to a half spawn um, with Cinny. We'll probably just bum and rush this. But he should anyway. Yeah, he, he definitely could have positioned himself a bit better there. A bit unfortunate. Um, you got a tweak. And he didn't get long, so that's something. But defensively, it looks like, you know, Generation faces Team Tea Time. They, they have good reads and they have good comms. So, Tinji can have to be pretty coordinated to, uh, to beat this. Jesus, Stoogie. Balls on you to just run in there. He enters, uh, back way. Doesn't work out for him. Yeah, so Suji yoloing into dark isn't the best idea, that's for sure. Just go in there, Cinny. Just repair the tank a bit. And yeah, just a, sort of a free setup for um for tea time. Rhino's in a bit of a mix-up position, or a station in standard position. No real forward spotting coming in from uh, from generation, but. If Synergy don't coordinate themselves well, they're not really going to be able to capitalize on that anyway, so... It's bum rush through mid. The it's all but done. Gives. A defensive airstrike on the tank. No, was that offensive? Yep. Offensive airstrike on the tank. Gets a kill, but... Uh, unfortunately, no repair coming in here. And the defense is resetting, so there's two down for the defense. The Aura and the, the Rhino are back up. So... Oh, almost. Yeah. Suji, just uh, last man standing. So, Suji really needs to position himself to, to get a pick and and not get longed. Because if he wants to bring that big fucking rifle to this fight, he wants to make sure it's actually doing work. Because better, he'd be way better off as a Fletcher or something. No question. Oh, I with it. Was that a gift? I believe so, yep. That heavy stand. So is but the rest the of my team. <laughs> the aura is doing work, so that's that's face himself, the man himself. He's playing um, better than Presh. Hey. <laughs> that's like saying this guy's blue, mate. That kid. Presh is uh, Presh is pretty good. As long as they're on Super Nintendo. So Suji's just trying to put some pressure on. Oh, Su Suji gets the headshot kill on the Rhino. 
This is good. Um, where are we here? That's the that should be the repair on the tank. Yep, tanks up. This is good stuff. We got a tarantula, I believe his name is Mumble. Running back to the generator. And uh, I've got a message for Presh from Juzzkid saying get on TS. And he's also dedicated a uh, song, Kiss from a Rose, by Seal to you coming up after the break. But uh, back into the game, we've got Stooji still with the sniper, tank rolling, dash with the nader. Sinny lagging out in the middle of the road, doing the dongo oh. on us. That's not, that's not the best place to lag out, I find. Um, so, Dash, getting those nade shots onto the, uh, the old generator. And stopping people from killing him, so this is good, he's doing work. Doogie's on EV duty, so... Doogie with a headshot! Long spawns their flesher, defensive flesher, down. And, uh, no one in generator, they're just gonna shoot it. Which is about right. It's all but dead, I think. And I think the tank is in, yeah, tank's in position. So as long as they can blow the generator, they'll be able to get the tank past. And my kingdom for a way to see the health on these things in spec mode. That wasn't your best idea there, Chrome, to revive your... Revive your fragger and put yourself both along. But the generator has been destroyed and the tank is moving up. So good coordination there, I think. Change me. Dash was thankfully left pretty much alone for that. He he was able to kill the guys that came from one at a time, which is handy. And he got the gen down and he's got the tank rolling, so pretty pretty solid work from him, but at the moment, faces team generation two time. They should just have a symbol. They should just change their name to a symbol like Prince Man. Right? So there's too many names. But, uh, Two they... heading upstairs to ammo racks. Yeah, and they've got a defensive fletch happening here. They've kind of whiffed the airstrike for the tank though. Um, it does need to do a trigger, so at least that's only a 20 second um, cooldown for the Skyhammer. The so Chrome's trying to get a little bit of movement on the tank. Nice offensive turret there by Dash. But we can expect another airstrike to come in from the defense. That's assuming that their Skyhammer wasn't dead, which he is. So, Encia and Chrome, nice little combo there, you know. Pretty much holding hands, getting the tank rolling. And this is clutch time at the moment. That tank's there. Good times. And, yeah, the airstrike wasn't enough to get it in time. Tea time, scrambling to get back into the bank, or the GH building, or the place where the objectives are. And, Synergy, rushing in the front, with one medic and Stooji, a sniper. What can Suji do as a sniper? They're all on flat ground, Stooge. Take him out, bro. Bang! Oh, Jesus, yeah, yeah, she did. Back rage by straight out of... I keep thinking straight out of Compton. <laughs> Chrome. Oh, bang, sparks on the OBJ. That's what I like to see. Fast movement character with the objective. Running it out. Oh, do the hard side. Good stuff. Is he doing the hard side? Yep. That's the way I like it. Nice and hard. So, Chrome was just like, last man, you know, hashtag YOLO, trying to stop the reinforce from getting back into the bank as quickly as they, as they can. Ensia, this guy is good. Seriously, someone pick up Ensia, poach him. He's good, he's good at the video games. Um, Stooji has the docks and he's run them to front door, but they're going to get picked up. I'll let Iceman know that he wants to uh, poach someone. Yeah, no, nah, look, I reckon is the next Rico. You heard it here first. Um... So that was a really great conversion from Synergy to get that first dox. But now, obviously, they've got to break this defense. Now, straight out of Compton, killed himself and a teammate. That's not so great, but Synergy haven't been able to sort of capitalize on that. So good damage control there by uh, by T time. They are struggling a little bit to, I think, find their mojo around the bank. They're just sort of feeling their way out to defensive positions now, so they can rotate. Doogee MM1-ing. You could get disqualified for, for global at any moment. 
Yeah, I'll make sure to tell the game ops. Yeah. Just get get onto Iceman's fucking astrology yeah. astronomy <laughs> site. Just post on his forums, let him know. Tell I him actually I looked on there the other week. He still updates it. You would look on there. Yeah, that I don't want to my blog. Never. But anyway. So Suji's trying to get a pick or put some pressure on the front, keep him distracted. But uh, no luck with the pick as yet. The flank's trying to come in from the offense on the uh, sort of garden side, but is it going to work? I think they need to change up this uh, Sparks and the Sniper. But what can they change to? They got a Fletcher? That would help definitely. And yeah, I reckon they need a Fletcher. They need something to blow these motherfuckers up. Hell, they even have you. a Phoenix. Oh, there you go. Stooge changed up to the Nader. Alright, Stooge. Time to bring some pain. But, conversely, to not sound biased, tea time, it's also time to give pain yourselves. It's time to give and receive pain here in Australian DB's Open Ladder Grand Final. And NC is he's going for the spawn side attack at the moment with a medic. So we've got Chrome and NC pushing together. So this, if they can get their shit together, this could be good. But they're coming up against the Fletcher, so. NC cops a sticky nade to the head. Well, uh, that medic just pushes him past him and gets down. Dash and, is just uh, chilling at the front door. Straight out of Mumble decided to hit his own medic in the face, so I don't know why. Probably, I don't know, does that count on black on black crime? I think it does. But uh, another wipe on, on Synergy, unfortunately. Um, they had a great conversion, as I said, for grabbing the first OBJ, but time have found their feet here and they've got some nice rotation and reactions happening so it's four on four push coming in from the garden side lots of fletcher spam going down though on them we've cleared the inside no uh -huh, he didn't clear the area though okay apparently he shot him with the objective And that's a long spawn for NC here, so they really kind of need to stage here. Because they synergy are at a big risk of just getting completely out of uh, out of spawn waves. And um, losing yep. their chance to break open. Oh wait, whoa, hello, Chrome! No! Goodbye, Chrome. You got flesh and it. So Chrome had a nice little steal there. Oh, Stoogey. My god. That's, as a Nader player, that is one of your worst nightmares. So I think, you know, bad thing about that is it can get into NC's head and team's head from that TK from the flip, from the, um, from the Nader. The reality is there were still three players up for defense, so there was a very slim chance that he would have been able to cap that objective, but it's still unfortunate. But um, it's a pretty good raise coming in from tea time, that's for sure. Suji goes down for a short spawn, so after catching a net. Oh, he goes back to sniper as well. A bloody Fletcher. Yeah, that Fletcher is. He's just shutting down that, that spawn reinforcement corridor. Um, and that is where they're putting. You know, I'm not going to say. Like their best players, or, but a, two consistent players in this match have been Chrome and Encia. And it's definitely a good combination to have, but. You're putting them in a very small choke point versus a Fletcher. There's only so much that they can really do. Though I'll probably send Stooge around to contest that guy, to be honest. But now they've gone, fuck it. We're going to put four guys through this one corridor. Can Can't stick you us all. <laughs> JK, they, could t they catch a bloody triple nade. See, so you saw the Fletcher, you <laughs> called out JK. And look, he didn't stick you them all. Let's just say that. But unfortunately, school bus. He, uh, he had a little present, let's just say. So another triple nade. That's two triple nades for school bus. That's that's huge, man. So that's really going to be getting into Synergy's head, and you can't you can't say a bad word about uh, about T times rotations here. They, they're just really smart. Um, but wait, whoa! Have we got an objective in play? Yep. Do we have an objective in play? Well, Is it going to get capped? Stoogie did die, but the docks are right next to it. So we got guys coming from garage. There's an airstrike on it. I reckon it'll just fine. in time. Yeah. 
Though, you know, every time I say tea time's doing great, Synergy, they, they pull off a shifty. So, you know, read into that what you will. But, um... Pretty much yeah. a full hold. Yeah, Four and minutes. it was a really good defense there by, um, by tea time in that last phase because it would have been very easy to get sort of double rolled, but they kept it together, so... I think in terms of, you know, if Synergy can hold them out for as long as they, they possibly fucking can, they could get into some interesting situations with... Well, ultimately, it has to... They have to hold for the full time, right? But, um... The objectives were pretty spaced out. Like, we didn't have any really fast caps on any sort of, like, spot, so... Yeah. They're gonna have to do it all. Names. All of Just it? in case you didn't know. All of it. They're gonna have to go all the way. To the hilt, my friend. Oh dear. Indeed. Alright, what do we got? Offensive sparks. No. Yes, no. Phoenix. It has an X in it. It's the same. Wait, no. Anyway, we got an offensive Fletcher. Um, and we don't have a defensive Rhino. Uh, they're right. waiting for the airstroke from, uh, office. We got four just chilling at stairwell while well, they throw the airstrike down. Straight out of Mumble picks up two. And the NC gets back raised by a couple. That's a wipe. That's a wipe, people. So, what's his knack is fucking tea time. They had that sweet little tricky airstrike thing that hits uh, the back of the EV. Happening on the bridge, um, but there was no Rhino pause. to take out. Oh, oh, oh! Is that pause? Yep. All right, that's pause. No, nope, we crashed the server. Ref D man to the rescue. Um, yeah, I think they were expecting that aura station to be there. That's the only reason you would use that airstrike. Yeah. Position anyway. Yep. So. Synergy have a lot of faith in Suji. Um, you know, because if the sniper's not hot, you know, even the nader spam is going to get more more results than, than some whiffed uh, sniper shots, so hopefully it pays off for them. Um, pretty standard otherwise. I mean, the, the defensive class setup from Synergy is maybe what you would have seen in ODC times. There's nothing too funky there. And offensively, they've got a flet like uh, tea time. They've got a Fletcher. They've got a Phoenix and a Skyhammer. Fragger Sawbones. So the Fletcher and the Phoenix could uh, make for some interesting offensive pushes. Yeah, I saw the Phoenix played a bit today in the uh, the US Dirty Bomb Nation tournament. Yeah. Yeah, you went all right. Nothing spectacular. Yeah, weapon wise, I mean, I've uh, I played a lot of Kek 10 being a bushwhacker. Everyone thinks the Kek 10 is fucking amazing. Pretty good. But, I don't know, because they keep nerfing the crots, right? Yeah. 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 And the old auto sniper. <laughs> so many people use that. Yeah. What we got here? So, here that we go is... again. Ping's even worse, apparently. Oh, there we go. Yeah, settling down. So, tea time staging in the office, trying to get some damage out to the EV. NC here takes out the Skyhammer. Got two in stairwell. Stooge just wrecked someone's office, gets taken out. So, the aura is hanging out behind the tank, but where is his aura station? Oh no, it's in dark. Bang. Problem solved. But just, you know, cancel that. So, aura station in the turret in dark, which is a nice little sort of nook to, to put it in. Um, got a phoenix sort of staging for hallway at the moment. So I think the offense are kind of figuring out where the defense is sitting up. And to be honest, they're just a couple of sticky nades away from breaking that open. Um, they just have to get a read on it. So we've got another tricky airstrike going, 
up on the oldie, uh, what's his knackers bridge, and the push should be coming in shortly. Honestly, if that doesn't get anything, it wouldn't, because they've now spotted where all the deployables are. If that doesn't work next time, just jump straight off the bridge and go behind Red Van with an airstrike and right. cover. So, two on one, and the defense comes out on top. So, look, NC went out, but he got a nice give on the fragger. Because that could have gone either way if um, if that fragger had gotten revived. But yeah, as you said, they know where the deployables are now. So, I might keep an eye on the straight out of Compton guy and see what's, uh, what he's got in store. Is Suji playing aggro, What's that on your... which is, you know, he likes to do that, he likes to do some unexpected shit, but I mean, it could cost him big time. He does take the, the NG quite a bit. Phoenix seals him up. Stooji picks up a double. And it's just a 4 on, four on 1 at the moment. Um, deployable still up at least, the aura station is, and the, the turret is back up as well. Yeah, they, they were broken, but yeah, they put them back up. And you know what? They're gonna, like, tea time are gonna have to play for a wipe at the moment because they're not even trying the War of Attrition on that tank. And, you know, to Synergy's credit, they're not really letting them get that far. They're sort of keeping them guessing a little bit. Um, and Synergy getting some nice spotting sort of on ramp. We've got Sydney doing some, some jumper roonies. So it looks like a, an office push. And the airstrike looks like it's going to be bridge again. But, uh, oh, I tell a lie, it was green. And the offense is pushing green from office, so this is good. Did exactly what I said and pushed behind the red van. And then NC, NC picks up a double. <laughs> he does, but one of them got revived, so it's still two minutes of green. But NC says, hey, <laughs> sorry. This is my area. Suji was there too, but he was pretty much just watching. He was getting, he was pretty much the cuck while NC was getting the kills. Um, so, still a nicely coordinated push from T time, but the reaction came in um, from Synergy and, you know, they got the wipe. Two in office at the moment. One just died on bridge, railway, and the NG's about to die momentarily. So they're pretty much trying the same thing again, but boys, you can't push around on the back if you let them chill in dark, because they will come and shoot you in the butt. Yeah, the only way that uh, back push is going to work is with the airstrike. Yeah, well, the thing is, the airstrike's not going to do them much good because they're basically not chilling in airstrikeable spots, which, Synergy's credit, is smart, right? Um, on the on the flip side, two time they came. They've obviously come to this game with some plans and a couple of airstrikes here, but unfortunately, they they just don't hit where the defenders are sitting. Oh, NC no. with a double. So you know, school boss gets his triples, but NC is getting some consistent doubles. So you know, you tell me who's the better friend. But it's not a competition, James. You don't get a certificate of participation here. And everyone's trying their best. So Suji's still playing super close on hallway. But uh, he's being diligent with his gives, which is good. And it looks like tea time, they're kind of losing it a little bit, I think, with the coordination. So I think, obviously Travis with his with his airstrike is, is the linchpin of their attack, or has been to this point. So they're good being sort of coordinated that way, but I think with the mix-ups, they're, they're definitely struggling. Yeah, the next time he uses his airstrike, he needs to change his nader and then just spam where those deployables are. Oh, which is actually moved now, where are they? In the usual spot. So, airstrike went over to green, but didn't sort of get anybody. Um, Stooji was punished from guys on bridge for being too aggro, so that was some, It was definitely a good pick by the offense. But, uh... Synergy looking comfortable. Definitely looking comfortable at the moment. So, at the moment, it's, it's really their phase to lose because they have a lot of chances to get that forward spotting at the moment and sort of set things up the way they like. Stick it warm. That's unless T Time can pull out something crazy. So, Dash is a uh, bit of a veteran player. He's played a lot of ET, so he understands 
the importance of forward columns, and he was getting a bit of forward spotting on the bridge guys just then, but he only fell off when he needed to, which is good. They're definitely allowing the synergy defense to sort of rotate as needed, but... There seemed to be a nice little mix-up there from tea time They sort of went to spiral stairs, I think, and sort of moved around, but... Unfortunately, things are happening at different times. Push is coming here, and then it gets rotated to and killed, and then vice versa. Yeah, so what do you think? They need to get moving. Like, they need to build this tank within the next... This push, really. So they're going to be held up for at least another minute or two on the generator. And then you get the harder spot, which is um, the bank. Yeah, definitely. But look, they took out the Aura Station. They got some nice spam on there. So tea time they took out a couple. And they, they seem to be there in numbers, but their Fletcher is longed, which is not a good uh. So the Fletcher is there. He's, he's, well, he's not gibbed, but... That's another wipe on two time. So, it's really unfortunate that Fletcher got taken down. That could have been a build on that push. And it's another reset coming in from Synergy, so... It's a little bit built on the tank, but... Nothing too major. And we got a hard ramp push coming in. Four over ramp, five over ramp. I think Travis was a new ET player, Iceman. So, the Fletcher's going in YOLO styles. He's going for the goblin build, which he is getting, I may add. Chrome is behind, doesn't really know. Suji's there too. Straight out of Mumble, should have just, just not actually... Build the tank! Yeah. He got a little bit hungry for kills there. Sometimes you've just got to... Pick up the NG if you need to. I will do it anyway. So, unfortunate there from... Uh, from straight out of Mumble, he if he had stayed on the tank and left them to fight out their fight, he may not have been noticed and we would be looking at a moving tank, but you know, sometimes you make decisions and they can go either way. I just suppose you look out for him that time. Dude so just Suji drops us well, and takes out Bickle and face. And it's three on two. The Fletcher has been, been long, yep. Same with his medic. Yeah, unfortunate. Like when you said, like it had to be on this push. They got really close. So, uh, unfortunately, they didn't make it. So the nade has finally come out. So Travis has switched up to that nade, as you as you suggested. But it, it has happened a bit late. And at the moment, I think, I don't know, would you say it's mathematically impossible at this point? I think it, it might be. Yeah, pretty much. you got what, yeah. 50 seconds on the dyno as well, so that takes it down to, we'll say, 3 minutes. Even if they did get the tank moving, and that still needs another what, 30, 40 seconds of uncontested movement. Uncontested movement. Yeah. Sounds like a porno. It will be when I'm finished. So, the tank is all but finished as well. Well, I think, uh, I think I actually just saw the engineer building the barrier. Yeah, it's built, so the tank's been built. Oh, okay. So, Never mind, I'm dumb. Yeah, but you got looks no brains, mate. I think you got the better end anyway, <laughs> mate. You look that good, you don't need to be smart. If you goes down for 15. So you called it, James. You know, if Travis has switched that nader, but early you might have seen him an earlier build. So expect an offer from uh, all players industries to be our uh, strategist slash coach and also speech therapist because I can't pronounce strat strategist. Want real strats? Get mob box. You may uh, made most of atmosphere strats or tofu. Ah, uh, good old tofu. I've only beaten Tofu once in my career. That's uh, that's all I needed, mate. I'd already, that that was the peak for me. But he was pretty much like Obi Wan Kenobi. He got struck down. and He came back stronger, mate. And we all know what happened after that. So tanks rolling up to the barrier. 
barrier is built. Still looking mathematically impossible. T time going through the authentic strat that the Nader set up to try and hit that gen. They're hoping for the best. You know, it would have to be perfect. I think the barrier, yeah, has been broken. So now all they have Tank's to do is gone. clear it out for the NG. Oh, just, okay, I thought it was broken. Tanks rolling, James. Have we spoken too soon? Tip okay, rolling, rolling, rolling. Tanks destroyed, but it's going to get repaired pretty soon. Because the spawn respawns come in from the offense. NG's but down for now. Well, for now, I mean, 20 seconds is... But Dash is pretty much Dash is pretty much the objective carrier right now because he has the airstrike in his pocket. Is it charged? We don't know. But the tank isn't even built yet, so he's just making sure he's shooting people in the back while they're trying to get some forward ground. I'm changing man. But he loses the one-on-one -on -one versus um versus Stadion slash Travis. But all right, so we got the tank going. Are we going to see an airstrike? Probably not, because Dash is dead. Yeah, Stoogie can throw his golf ball at it, but it won't do much. It'd have to be fucking Tiger Woods to do something with the tank with the golf ball, mate. So, Dash, you had better throw a good fucking airstrike, buddy. I'm watching him. He's going up. He's making sure it doesn't get hit on the fucking ridgy thing over the top. He's gobbling. Is he going to whip it? He's whipping it. Oh, yeah. He's whipping it good. He he's whipped out real good. And he gets the NG as well. And his own medic. I was going to say that redeemed him for Chapel, but then he was like, nah, I'm going to take out Sunny too. So, you know, sorry Dash, not redeemed. But, that looks like the mathematical impossibility we needed for Synergy. So, wow. Did you see that coming, James? Did you see it coming? I didn't have a doubt. Oh wait, this is your team. Yeah. <laughs> oh yeah. Wait. So, okay. Well, congratulations. <laughs> but look, you know, I had a hard game it. there. I worked really hard on what I did. Mate, you got a hard earned thirst, mate. Just crack open a tinny, mate. Just enjoy yourself, right? But look, great games. Went to the decider. And look, tits hunt. They didn't give up. They kept going. They tried. They didn't give up. They tried to fucking get it to the thing, get the fucking stuff, but unfortunately, Synergy had the answer. Synergy 2-1, grand final winners. Cyber Gamer, Dirty Bomb, Open Ladder Champions. I'm gonna give School Bus the MVP. 60 kills he got. I reckon if you got NC or School Bus on the team, mate, you wouldn't need anyone else. Oh, but they're both fraggers. Can't run two fraggers, not when they're being banned next season. Look. To, to move into the post-game show, <laughs> uh, talking about cyber gamers' rules and change-ups, well, apparently you can run two supports now. So, fast forward, you know, two months, you might be running four fraggers and a medic. So, who even knows what will happen. But, uh, good cast, good games. Next season, I wonder what we're going to do. Vote combined ladder. Vote combined ladder. No two supports. Sorry, I just had to get that out. Anyway, we have a one day cup coming up on the 11th, I believe, to try out some different CG rules. Which I'll be streaming, I'll have some other people trying out for casting. Uh, Abolisher and Ecstasy, I believe, want to cast it. Have you lots? Have you yeah, you you lot signed up for that, didn't you? Yeah, we'll be we'll be there. So I'll be playing, or coaching, or subbing, or knitting a quilt. So yeah, good cast names. Yep, and that's the uh, that's the end of the open league. I'm not sure how long it will take to do the next league because I'm not an admin, so I don't know this shit. So anyway, Synergy wins 2-1. I'll have the demo, well, demo, recording up soon. Good games.